How's it going everyone? Today is the day. It is cup final day. Yes, it is the Morrison Freight Cup final and we are against Codnam Athletic and here are your lineups. Um, despite the injury worries not too long ago, um, Roger Johnson and Luke Hurst both make the team and yeah, Matt, it's been, build up has been good. We have been in tremendous form and I'm looking forward to this game and nervy, nervy semi-final, but we still scraped through. And uh, in traditional fashion, the laptop has frozen. Right, I think we shall stick with what is good. Um, let's give the fans, but let's go passionate for this one, I think. I mean, it says they're the one who really pay your wages, but this is the everyone's on an amateur contract and they get new money. But still, it's the thought that counts. And there we go. We have a tunnel interview. The press coming in their numbers today. Can he? I think he lost the full match. And they're making some silly questions here. Are you hopeful that Hussein Jaffa carries on his recent good form? No, I, I hope he becomes awful. And that is that, and we are on to the kickoff. Come on, boys, bring home this trophy, and let's get the double in our first season. Will it be raining, though? That is the question. Nobody will find out because there must be ice because it's frozen once again come on boys and Luke Hurst starts the game hopefully we can uh, carry on this good form put in a decent performance and not have uh, the stress of that semi-final because I don't think I can take another one of them that was a uh, Someone else. Hudson Adoy now. Bomb your past. Kiji. Oh, it doesn't quite make it to his man. And the defenders deal with it. Still putting pressure on Hudson Adoy now. Good pressure for Matt Carr there. Carr now to Hunt. Hunt goes along to Kiji on the left. Early pressure here for Southwell Town. Kiji puts the ball in Hurst. Ooh, chest over the bar. Would have been a perfect start to this cup final. But it wasn't meant to be. But we already have our first shot on the board. And that is hopeful for the rest of the game. But Codnam have a free kick. Whips the ball in. Headed over the bar. Now, we played really well. Codnam are in our division. Um, so it is a division one. Not, not a single top flight team in this competition final. And we have played well in this league. But this is a cup final. So there are never any guarantees. 20 minutes in now. Things seem to be at a bit of a stalemate. Not too much happening. But we have a corner now on the 23rd minute. Carr puts the ball into the box. First, Hudson the way off the bar and the shot is cleared. And he's out for another corner. So close to taking the lead there. Car now with another corner, puts the ball in the box. Great defending there from the Codlin defenders. And they cleared the danger. Now Ives, can he make a counter-attack here? Tries to get past his man. And the cross is deflected away for a throw-in. Our fitness is ever so slightly better than theirs, but not as enough, I would say, to make much of a difference. And as we approach the half an hour mark, we've had only two shots on target in the entire game. Carton out with a long free kick, puts the ball in, headed away from the from the box by the defenders. Hurst now latches onto the loose ball, back to Miller, out wide to Carter. Hudson Adoy, oh, ho, ho. so close. I'm looking for Carter to make an impact. He's got tons of assists this season. All we're doing um, after this. 
finally comes in. After this game, we're going to be doing a end of season review video, just going over the goal scorers, assists, you know, the usual. Cotton out on the left, and the cross is blocked and has gone out for a corner. Yeah, Makai has something ridiculous. He's almost, I think he's almost something silly like an assist a game on average. Hurst now dispossesses his man. Surges into the Codnam half. Gets past his man. Oh, he's a man with confidence right now, isn't he? Neil does a little turn for no reason. Back to Hunt. Jaffa now goes along the Hudson the door. He controls it well. Can't quite get past his man though. Passes it to Carter in the middle. Goes back to Miller. Hunt now. Nice tidy pass in here. Nice patient build up a key G. Oh, on the volley, but he sends it high. And we have a throw in now. Numar to Akiji. Whoops, the ball in. Hudson Adoy. Yes. And we have taken the lead. Hudson Adoy is Cottenham Athletic. Nil. South Old Town won. 23rd goal of the season for one of the players of the season. One of the many players of the season. And we are in the lead just before half time as Roger Johnson picks up. His first yellow card of the season. As long as he doesn't get another one, I will be happy. And the referee brings the first half to a close. It was quite a tight game. But luckily we are ahead and seem to be on top of things now. And I am happy with your performance. On to the second half. And Cottenham get things underway. And immediately we get a throw in on our right hand side. Come on boys. Miller now throws it to Carter. Carter back to Miller. Jaffa's on the ball. Goes long, finds only the defender's head. But the defender can only head it to Carter. He passes it to Newell. Goes out wide to Hudson the Doy. Gets past his man. Very easily. Takes a shot and it is wide of the post. Probably could have and probably should have cut the ball into the middle. But when you've got an eye for goal like that man, Hudson the Doy, you want them goals. And we are 55 minutes in, approaching the 60th minute. And whatever happens in this highlight will define the substitutions I'm about to make. Abraham Youngs now holds the ball up to Potter. Harry goes long to Ives. Great pass. Ooh. Potter nearly there with a magic assist. Wonderful pass. And 60th minute. And we will wait until this highlight finishes. We have the throw. Hurst now. Oh, wonderful pass to Ikiji. We are going so close. It's kind of hard to take anybody off at this stage. I mean, we're playing very well, but if we can get them. And would you know, it is frozen once again. I don't even know what is going on. There we go. There we go. Right. We can bring on a bit more experience in the middle. Take Hunt off, put Cleveland Taylor on. If the game, I mean, here's a pretty big game. Maybe the computer's struggling with this as well. We can. There's not really much else I want to change. We will put Mendy on for Newell. And yeah, this I'm gonna leave the defence as it is. And we are attacking as I can firmly substitutions. What can happen? Oh the shots are raining in. Oh, 
so close again to a second goal there. And the substitutions are made, hopefully the fresh legs in the centre of the park. A bit of experience as well from both players. Um, hopefully that will pay dividends. Now it's Hudson and Doyle now bombing past the right. He gets past two men. Hurst now. Oh, he tucks it away. Go on, lads. Cottenham Athletic Neil South Old Town 2. And we look very good. And if we carry on like this, we're going to be doing the double. If Hurst can get a hat trick, he'll make him, that'll make him 30 goals this season. Some of the big non-league clubs will be sniffing around trying to sign some of these players, no doubt. Hopefully we can keep some of them going in next year. Because I think if we can keep the base of this squad, I reckon we've got a good chance for maybe even another promotion. Oh! That's Codden and Fleck. Ball it back. Glimmer of hope there. Fantastic cross and header. And the defence was caught sleeping. One shot on target all game. And that has made the difference. The super sub Tilson. Now we've got 10 minutes now. It's going to be a bit nervy. And hopefully we can hold on. If they equalise, I'm going to be spitting feathers. Come on boys, 5 minutes plus added time left. You can do this. So close. Now we've got a free kick now. That's an doy. Oh, look at you with the rebound. Oh, he was offside. Would have made things so much more comfortable. Throw in now. Miller on the right. Cleveland Taylor there. Hurst puts the ball in. Mendy always oh, left footed volley. Smashes the defender. And 20 seconds left. Could this be it? Oh, I think. Yep, yeah. that is it. Hudson Odoi with his brace and his 24th goal of the season makes it Cotton Athletic 1, Southold down 3, and I think the trophy is ours. Come on, boys, just pass it around nice and tidily. And there we go, the final whistle is blown. We are champions of the Morrison Freight Cup. And we're going to share a celebration. There we go. Look at them. Look at them. Wonderful squad of players. Such high definition. And there's the man, the manager, carrying the trophy, leading the team, and ruin, ruining the commentary. Well, there we have it, guys. That is the last game of this 2019 to 2020 season. We have won the league. We have won the cup. We have done the double. And we have had some fantastic performances from so many players. And I would just like to thank each and every one of you for following this journey. I promise after this season, I will be working on making these videos and this content that bit, that that bit more, um, a little bit more easier to listen to, and I'll try I'll, uh, I'll try and improve on my uh, top-notch commentary. But as for now, guys, don't forget to you got to make sure you hit that like button if you're watching this video for the uh, for the double. And uh, yeah, comment any ideas that you may have for next season or any other kind of side projects you might be interested in me doing, little experiments maybe using the in-game editor. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, share the stuff with your friends and your family and on the social media. And as always, I will post the link to the Football Manager South Wild Town Twitter account and also the real South Wild Town Football Club account on Twitter. Be sure to give both of them a follow, especially the real team, because they are a great bunch of lads, great football team, and they deserve all the support they can get. Anyway, See you guys next season. We did the double.